Hi guys and welcome back to Archie Hamilton Racing and to another video where today you join me where I'm at Goodwood but we are just about to drive the all new Range Rover Sport flat out today. This is what's going to happen. The all new Range Rover Sport is directly behind me. I'm going to walk you through the car and then what we're going to be doing is we're going to get a chance to drive it. This might be a first because I've not seen any videos of the all new Range Rover Sport going for it. Today we're going to push it up the Goodwood Hill and we're going to really enjoy it. It's going to be amazing. A car which is longly anticipated and today, like I say, we're going to get a chance to see the full true performance of it. So let's get going. So here we have the all new Range Rover Sport everybody in this amazing colour and like I say, we're going to just have some fun with this today. We're going to get a chance to push it enjoy it and everything else this car comes in some amazing color as you can see it's like gray it's kind of nardo gray but it is super super cool this one is fast it's 530 rough brake horsepower it's cool it's hundred and twenty thousand pounds and it does 0 to 60 in 4.3 seconds called vericine blue Vericine blue is the actual colour of this car. Uh, so this is officially the V8 version, uh, which might be a little bit confusing, but you can tell straight away because it's got the four part, the two pipes there and the two there equals four. I must be going mad. Uh, so that's very, very cool. And it's actually called the P530 First Edition. I love the new look of this Range Rover Sport. It has so much presence and uh, really, really, really does look the part. I love all this section. It's just so, so cool. The V8 version, for me, I saw the diesel version earlier, but this is the one for me. It really is a cool bit of kit. And if we go here, we can see that on the road, 120,000 pounds pretty much is yours. Standard spec, 112. But yeah, it's uh, it's a very, very cool. Maximum power, horsepower, 530. Maximum torque, 750. So we are now inside the all new Range Rover Sport. Oh, I'm so happy to be inside it. It is so, so cool. The comfort levels. I feel like I'm <laughs> on my sofa. This is more comfortable than my sofa. Let me show you how nice is all of this. This car has done 300 miles, so it's not as high mileage car as you can imagine but look at all this amazing forged carbon it's pretty much forged carbon which is nice we have meridian sound system we have 22 inch adjustable passenger massage seats so that's very cool as well it's very nice gentlemen's taking me up today are we gonna fire it up yeah let's go for oh, it oh yes What mode are we in? Are we in dynamic? Yep. Oh yeah. Dynamic mode is the mode to get the noise out the exhaust. We have three different modes. We've got a whole series of modes of the train response. Let's go to the... The screen's so good, isn't it? Yeah, great, easy to reach, swift response. <sighs> Out of information at the angles. <laughs> it's so good. I mean, it gives you everything. All the modes, eco mode. Eco mode, comfort mode, grass, gravel, snow, mud ruts, chaos, sand, <laughs> rock crawl. When are you crawling through rocks? Ah, well, you, the car will do it. <laughs> oh, it's so cool. Wade. What is that? I mean, so go through, I think it's a 900 millimeters of water, nearly a meter of water. No way. A millimeter of water. 900 mil. Oh. Fantastic. All right, so we're going to quickly talk to you about the, the key features of this car. Yeah. The active, we've got suspension technology. We've got the first time we've ever had switching air springs, which means they can go from comfort into really sporty engaging. That's all done through terrain response That's control. so cool. It adapts the car to how you want it to drive, whether it's in cold, wintry weather, or like today, out on the circuit. And how is it for, well, we're going to find out for speed. Um, it, it's quick, handles well? 
absolutely fantastic. Yeah. We've got active roll controls to help keep the vehicle flat. We've got rear wheel steer, so low speed. Unreal. More agile. High speed, help stability. So today, flat out on the track, you should feel that. Yes. Right, we're ready to go. Here's the sport. I can't wait for this. Look at this. It looks amazing, doesn't it? Oh, it's just unreal. If you haven't seen, look at these 23 inch wheels as well. These wheels are absolutely absurd. These 20 inch wheels, 23 inch wheels. Right, we are just going up to the start line here in the Range Rover Sport. Are we ready? Yeah. <laughs> what are we in? We're in dynamic. Dynamic mode. Helmets on, we're good. Helmets on, oh. we're good. I'm actually really looking forward to going, like, going fast in this because it's just so much luxury. We've got the other Range Rover directly ahead of us. So now dynamic debut of the, the car in yes. the UK. Yeah, so this is the first sort of drive and it's gonna, does the steering go a bit heavier when you go into dynamic? Yeah, or? the electronic steering adds a bit more weight, a bit more feel to it. Allows me to really feel what's going <laughs> way on. Way that <laughs> Range Rover. Look at it go. So oh, I'm cool. excited. Get dynamic uh, launch. But now it's quick enough, isn't it? Wow. Absolutely. Up to the first corner, park, bend. Oh, wow. Shared a bit of speed. It handles nice, mate. Take a nice wide line through. Cut a bit of grass. Yes! Ah, flat out all the way. Mate, it's straight quick. Straight out, park straight. Under the bridge. Come on. Get me up to Malcolm. 100 odd miles an hour. Brake nice and early. Get that wow. speed off. In we go, Malcolm, tricky corner. Easy with this, nice flat control. Go up the hill, so the good. don't miss the flint wall. Don't miss the flint wall, yeah. Oh, on the brakes, look at that. Nice. Straight through, lovely V8 sound. Again, slightly tight, through we go. Oh, yes. Lovely stable feel with the rear wheel steer. Mate, it's unreal. Same here again, it's a bit under the trees. Nearly at the finish now, here we are. Yes, mate, I'm the throttle all the way. Mate, that is uh, brilliant. That's brilliant. You know what? That has amazed me in so many different ways. Like that, the handling of that is amazing. And think of the breadth of capability. This car can do all that off road, the rock core we talked about. You're driving the sand. Yeah. And yet, here we are, standard tyres. Fantastic on oh, the hill. Oh, mate, climb. genuinely, that is like really really amaze me like the fact of how the car drives is just amazing but the way the car turns in do you feel the rear wheel steer when you when you feel it you don't feel it what you get is we've got a very natural feel to the tune but you do feel the agility the car sort of shrinks around you feels lighter it feels agile but stable throughout that gives you the confidence to really you know, drive it hard wow i don't think it's the right word to say really surprised me but i think it just took my breath away a little bit just how the car really turned in exactly there's something at the end of the day it's a fantastic luxurious sports suv seats five in comfort and yet we've just been able to do a drive like that <sighs> mate i'm so good i'm so good <laughs> Glad and, you and how, how do you find it sort of if you were to put it on somewhere like a track it, it would handle nice wouldn't it yeah no we get a very nice balance as i say it's about being intuitive to drive yeah about Actually making it's bringing a smile to your face. It's not intimidating. No. It's got agility, but always comfortable. And the brakes? Ah, powerful, really powerful, reassuring, uh, consistent pedal feel throughout, and they'll stand up to some really good use. Perfect. So you've got the comfort on the on the road, and then as you can see from this uh, lovely gentleman, he uh, knows how to drive and uh, pushed it to its full potential as well. So uh, if you're thinking about one, go and buy one. I want one. Can't afford one at the moment. But that was mega. So done the hill climb. Can we go back to comfort? Yeah, absolutely. Let's switch it back round. <laughs> Just all like that. that. Scenario. All on the dash. On the dial's changed back. Bit more information. Bit well, more there we are on the navigation. Ah, yeah, we've got more Coming maps. down the hill. Got more maps, got everything else. And the ride is completely different. That is generally completely different, isn't it? When, yeah. the, when you do it like that. So that is a, well, a first drive of the all new Range Rover. It has been absolutely epic. And a uh, huge thank you to this gentleman who has uh, been hooning it giving it the beans, absolutely everything. Uh, we're actually just literally driving back down with the uh, F Pace SVR uh, and the Range Rover just in front as well. All the cars are heading back and shortly we'll be parked up. We have just jumped out of the Range Rover Sport and that was an amazing, amazing run. 
and uh, yeah, huge thanks to that gentleman, but we've had a really good run. Fun to, uh, to go in it, see it and everything else, but I hope you've enjoyed it. A little insight to the all new Range Rover Sport and a first drive pushing the car pretty much to its limits. The way it was then was just ridiculous. So yeah, I uh, hope you've enjoyed it. Leave your comments down below. How would you spec one? I'm real. I'm flipping real. Give this video a thumbs up uh, and leave your comments down below. And a huge thank you to Land Rover for inviting me to this epic opportunity. I'll see you